What's up, everybody? Let's Talk Jets Radio. Hope you guys are doing well, enjoying some nice weather on this Thursday. Uh, quick video with the news of the day that uh, the Jets are reportedly close to a multi-year contract extension with Morgan Moses, a uh, tackle from Washington. I, I think this is a great move. You know, Washington released him, I think it was back in May. He had been a six-year starter with them. Uh, pretty much all the experience on the right side, although I think he's played a couple games at left tackle when needed. Uh, for me, the biggest thing was that you were going to have some quality depth behind uh, Makai Becton if you made this move. But uh, with the, the reports that this is going to be a potential multi-year deal, uh, that suggests, obviously, that they could be replacing George Fant. Um, if they decided to release him now, I think it's about a $3.6 or $3.3 million uh, savings with about six point five in dead money, so I don't see them doing that. You still need some depth at tackle. I, I don't think anybody's confident with uh, McDermott or uh, Chuma Adoga backing up on the left side if somebody goes down. So I think it makes a lot of sense, but next year you could definitely move on. I think they can recoup almost all of the money on fans last year of his contract. Uh, so it's going to be interesting to see what they pay Moses. Um, but it looks like the intention is to potentially bring him in as your starting right tackle. Uh, I'll be honest, I was kind of curious to see what Fan could do in this new offense. I, I thought he brought some strength, some athleticism. He, he looked somewhat decent considering uh, how bad everything was last year. Uh, so I was a little bit intrigued to see what he could do uh, heading into this year with the new staff, uh, you know, new blocking system and all that. Uh, but competition's a great thing, and having some depth is even better. So go Jets. I like the move if it gets done. Hopefully it does get done, and uh, we'll talk to you soon.